Last summer, my friend Alex showed me this great bow tipper he had made out of bamboo skewers. It's an easy one-day project, and I decided to make one. First, you want to glue a bunch of bamboo skewers together. I did this in two stages because it's a little more complicated than you think. First, I glued six skewers hexagonally around a center skewer with carpenter's glue. Then, I waited for the glue to dry and added an outer ring of 12 more skewers. If you want to sound like a wood tipper, glue all along the length of the skewers. I'm after a different sound, so I glued only the middle sections of the skewers and not the ends. You'll need to cut down the pointy bits once the glue dries. First, deeply score the bamboo skewers one at a time. You can use a serrated kitchen knife for this. Then just bend forward. It'll break off pretty cleanly. Then you'll have to sand the ends. When you're sanding the ends, you need to wrap the stick pretty tight. The reason for this is because otherwise the stick bits will go everywhere and break off. So get some packing tape or something else pretty strong and keep a lot of tension on it as you're wrapping around the stick. Now you can pick up the stick and almost as if you were writing round and round and round in circles like that and get a nice smooth cornered edge. At this point you really could call it finished. I mean you've got a perfectly lovely bamboo striker here with two ends that are both very similar both in spread and in roundness which is important. The, di the distance by which the spines are separated must remain consistent across both ends of the striker. Here, just for reference, for size reference, is a sonic screwdriver. But if you leave it bare like this, you'll risk the skewers coming apart over time. So I wrapped this one using a bamboo flute binding technique, Google bamboo flute binding, and colored nylon cord. You'll also want to add some sort of center notch or ring to keep the striker position in your hand. The flute binding technique works great for building up a center nub. This one is five layers deep. 10 wide, then 9, then 8, then 5, then 3. Once everything is wrapped and bound to my satisfaction, if you know what I mean, I rub carpenter's glue into the cord. This stabilizes it permanently. Now let's try it. This is a standard bow run tipper. It's made of wood, and I suppose I shouldn't say standard because there's just too many. There are a lot of different type of bow run tippers. Note the nib in the middle where I've duplicated one on the bullrun tipper I just made. N listen to the sound here. Now let's try the new tipper, the one I just made out of bamboo. It's a more complex, slappy, lighter, brighter sound. Try making one yourself, it's easy. And it's a one-day project. Come visit crimeintheforcesofevil.com.